Hey guys, it's February 14th and as you can see, it is absolutely a beautiful day at Middle Creek here in Kansas. And uh, coming up on a submerged bridge, if you actually look straight across that away and straight across that way, that is Medcalf, uh, the main thoroughfare of Kansas City. Right about where that marker buoy is, there is a bridge I tossed that out there. You can see it right out over there. And on the side of that bridge, I marked a ton of fish, as you guys can see on the Garmin 7608. If you notice, this is the bridge, the top of the bridge, and on the downside of the bridge where the, where the fish and uh, the water usually goes under the bridge, you can just see tons of fish stacked up on that side, which would be the, uh, it would be the east side of the bridge. So we're going to target those fish and see if we can't find them. So uh, try to catch some Kansas crappie with crappie Kirby. Here we go. Okay, well we've set up on the bridge and uh, this is about the fourth crappie that I have snagged. And they are little. You can kind of notice I got him right in the back of the fin. Got some real sensitive poles here, but uh, that big group of crappie that we saw on the fish finder was a huge swarm, but I'm afraid after the fourth one of these, they're a little tiny crappie. So, if you want to see me catch another one? Should be fairly simple because they are stacked up so thick. I can actually feel them running into my line. So, I just drop down and uh, that's about the fourth one of those that I've uh, reeled in. I would not say caught. Uh, I've snagged them. So uh, they're down there pretty thick. I can feel them running into my line, and I've yet to have a crappie bite. So uh, we're going to give this another five minutes. I'll probably show you another snagged miniature crappie here. Oh, there's one. Uh, and then we'll probably move on uh, just because we want to target some bigger crappie. Kind of frustrating, but at the same time, uh, kind of a good indication of what a great reservoir, uh, small little lake, Middle Creek is in the way of its crappie population, because that is a ton of fish. And uh, I actually froze the screen so that you could see. And I'll show you again real quick, because I don't think I'm going to have any bites. I think we're only going to have snags, but take a look at this cool screenshot I got on the Garmin 7608 that actually shows the bridge in its complete clarity and the crappie schooled up behind it. Take a look. So there's the bridge, and there are all the crappie. That is the down view there, and that is uh, the traditional view, but the bridge is right there. You can actually even see the gap that the the grit that the bridge creates with this chirp sonar it's absolutely amazing but tons of fish stacked up here on the east side of the submerged bridge but unfortunately they are all little so we'll probably uh, be going someplace else hey guys we're back on middle creek lake it's february 15th day after valentine's day and uh, i just wanted to show you some of the detail that you can pick up on your 7608 garmin gps map it's absolutely amazing we tried the underwater submerged bridge and i think you guys saw some great detail on that but as i was going to one of my favorite spots to try for submerged february crappie i ran across an incredible rock pile with crappie behind it at about 28 feet. I paused the sonar. I'm gonna give you guys a uh, brief look at it and then we're gonna see if we can catch some of those fish at 28 feet deep. So take a look at this absolutely amazing detail. I have the side view here on the right and the traditional sonar here on the left and you can see the big boulders in the rock pile and you can also see them on the side view as well uh, they come in as the very heavy white uh, structures there on the bottom and if you see behind the rock pile boom 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 
hopefully crappy 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 or walleye 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 so uh, we're going to target those fish right there the neat thing about the touch screen you can push that uh, right where you want hit mark and boom you've got a mark right there regardless of where you're at when i went uh, over that i immediately threw a buoy marker i don't know if you can see it way out there we've kind of drifted off but that's our target area we're going to turn off uh the mercury and cruise in with the Minkota trolling motor and see if we can't pick a few of those crappie off and if we do turn the cameras on so you guys can see the action so very cool detail Garmin 7608 GPS map an incredible sonar for your boat